and welcome back to another video today here on Forza Horizon 4 again with Fail Games to try and see if we can survive a lap of the Goliath in stock Ultimas. So uh, basically for those of you who don't know the Ultima is a very high powered rear wheel drive car in Forza that is notoriously difficult to drive on a straight line um, or at least that's my experience of driving it. Um, they are rather difficult machines to drive um, but yeah we took them for one lap of the Goliath um, with AI in there to make it extra chaotic um, to see how, how well we could survive a lap in these things uh, whether we're actually any good at driving them or not um, but anyway this is what happened uh, in the race yes it's entirely necessary to have a rev counter a digital rev counter and the lights on the wheel oh well, so why are the lights not centered oh very fancy golf livery. Oh wow, yours is very multicolored. <laughs> oh, there's a Mosler and an IE and the Rimats. Oh no, right. a Lego Bugatti, really? Yes. Also, something I should point out while we're at it: technically, petrol's the better driver. Oh! Since March of 2020, only once have I been ahead of him in the driver's standings at the end of a month oh. for community race, fuel injection, or DRS. And it was in September. So that tells you how much better petrol theoretically is. That's my excuse for being last. Out of the way. Ah, I've crashed again. Oh no, that's a shot. I was doing quite well. <laughs> ah! I've spun oh. again. Why is there a McLaren that's over there? Okay, we've got a drunk driver. Oh, we've got three cars in the pub. Oh, you found the McLaren. Yeah, he was doing yes, very strange things. Two other cars in the pub. Oh, there's a something yellow in a tree. Oh, you get, um, you, you might want to slow car, down for the water nice. splash. Oh, I've just missed it. Oh, I've, I'm in a lake. The water splash completely killed me. Oh, this sounds interesting. I love how I went off the moment I said, this car isn't actually that bad once you get back. The handling isn't quite as good as I'd expect. Go off spun. I think I was going to slide about quite a lot more. I didn't expect to slide, I was just expecting understeer, spin, understeer, spin. Oh, are those two in a river? What? Where are they going? <laughs> oh, he's got very lost. Goodbye, Apollo. How did you beat an Apollo? Uh, Edinburgh straight. <laughs> what, has this car got a top speed? 243. Ooh. Should I risk it cr cutting the roundabout? I sort of did. Oh, I did and I've missed a checkpoint. If petrol were to have a massive accident, I might still be in with charts. I'm back here, AI. Come on, if I can't take this corner flat out, what is the point of this car? I can! Oh! Oh! No! You was that a massive stupid accident? ultimate. It was quite a big accident. Oh! Well, goodbye, Apollo. Oh, this thing is really shaky and really fast down the street. I might have hit a wall that threw me into another wall and then into another wall and then spun me around. Excellent. I knew we should have put on the sim damage. Oh no, wait, I'd be dead at this point. <laughs> oh! Okay. There's a slight crest there where you take off and have a crash. Excellent. 
Okay, my challenge is to not DNF. Uh, you know, I have a question was, can we drive an ultimate? I think the answer is yes, but not very well. Because let's be honest, we'd both be dead. Yes. I'm driving terribly, but I'm still driving it a lot better than I thought I would. <laughs> That's pretty much what's happening here. Oh, he says as he goes off. I'm in a forest I've never been to before. Have you made it to the stupid corner of a windmill yet? Uh, no, I'm on the Broadway straight heading to that corner now. Ah. This is why I don't like this Ultima, because that's what I imagine when I think about it. Just constant left, right, left, right, slide, left, right, slide, right, left. I've safely Flash. navigated the corner, and so have all of the AI somehow. I'm gonna DNF, aren't I? Goodbye, stupid red supercar that they... Oh no, he's pulling away again. Come back here, you... Oh, why are they all breaking? Yes, goodbye, stupid red supercar that they jumped out of a building in that silly movie. <laughs> the VW Lincoln. Or something like that. Yes. Also, am I the only one that's confused why it's the Lycan Hypersport? What happened to the normal Lycan? Is, wasn't that what it was always called? Exactly. Normally, Hypersport, Supersport, or things like that mean it's an upgraded version of a standard car. The uh, other word version got crashed out of the window. <laughs> also a finished. <What>? How? <laughs> I haven't even made it to the stupid corner yet with a windmill. And I've managed to beat a Mosler, a Lycan, an Apollo, and a McLaren. But I've lost to a Lego car. Excellent. So there we go. Um, that is what happened in today's challenge. One lap of the Goliath in the rather difficult to drive Ultimas. Um, which actually proved to be easier than we imagined, but still quite difficult. Um, I would be quite interested to see what time these would do um, without spinning out, or what time I could achieve in this car without spinning out. I think my worst one was when I hit the water splash there, but had a couple of offs. Um, but yeah, it turns out they're not actually as bad as, as we imagined or as remembered, but yeah, they are still fairly difficult things to drive uh, completely stock uh, on any Forza game. Um, but yeah, that is going to be all for today's challenge. As always, do go and check out Fail's channel, which will be linked in the description. Um, make sure you go and check out some of the content over there. Um, but otherwise, that is going to be all for today's video. So thank you very much for watching, and I will be back with the next video very soon.